It is with great joy that we present our first Nesba Talks. Our model for these talks has been the TEDx Talks, but with a botanical focus and a connection of our work in botanical art to an incident we ran into in our lives. Today, we're having three women give our initial talks. Joan Pierce will talk about her presidency of Nesba and share her thoughts on the fascinating way she learned how to be a great president, which she was, she was, and what she would like to pass on about it. Deborah Cassidy will talk about Paul Stankard, a botanical glass paperweight specialist artist who makes his paperweights look so real that people think he encases real flowers in glass. Jan Boyd will then share her profound research into Fibonacci. Her deep dive into a way of understanding Fibonacci will change your way of seeing the natural world. A fourth person who planned on giving a talk was Elizabeth Farnsworth who passed away October 27, 2017. It is with great joy that we dedicate these talks in her memory. She was a botanist, a scientific illustrator, a scientist, a researcher, an, edu an editor, an adventurer, a musician, a kayaker, a conservationist, a teacher, and a passionate lover of the natural world and more. My own time spent with Elizabeth was fun and hysterical. I just loved her deep love for nature and the way she shared her love of nature. Her love was contagious. Her smile radiated even on the phone. She gave me four topics to pick from for her own Nesba talk, and I picked one, but truth be told, I wanted them all and was just waiting to get the first one over with before asking her for the next. I picked her talk on Puerto Rico, the Guanica Biosphere Reserve, in particular, the dry forests of Puerto Rico. She worked amongst bats, an amazing variety of plants, including a globally rare orchid, and was going to look at a new interaction among plants and associated ants. She wrote and illustrated a field guide to the reserve, which is still handed out to visitors today. Costa Rica, South Africa, Belize, she was an adventurer. What a courageous and fearless woman. A modern day Maria Sibylla Marion. I treasure my time with her and dedicate these talks in her memory. Thank you.